Degas is such a prolific artist of dance. It was the preoccupation of his career. More than half of his career was spent documenting dance. He was interested in the moments, um, the private moments of the dancers before or after a performance, doing something really personal, a different kind of intimate movement. Degas executed this wonderful pastel dancer with green tutu around 1887. And this is really the high watermark of his career. He was a successful artist and living off the fruits of his labor. And the prior decade was probably the decade of his most important and prodigious output. This also coincided with um, his burgeoning and then ever growing uh, fascination with dance. Um, he started in the 1860s frequenting the opera, the ballet, cafe concerts, the circus, and he was just obsessed with dance. And not just dance in its most theatrical and artful form, which he was interested in, you know, the dancers on stage and the poetics of their movement, but he was also interested in the intimate moments around the periphery. He was interested in rehearsals, in um, preparation, in backstage. That's really well captured here, uh, the attention to you know, a dancer folding over her body to perhaps you know, tie or lace a shoe. It would appear to be a moment either preceding or following a performance. She's in quite embellished, fantastic costume, and a lot of attention is given to the shimmering of the tutu with various colors, gold and pinks coming through the green, and that's echoed in other places on the sheet uh, very beautifully. And then, of course, it's all contrasted with the great intensity of the red and burgundies in the backdrop, suggestive of maybe a red velvet curtain that she's leaning against or standing in front of. Degas was distinguished um, for his use of really intense, vivid, vibrant color. He objected to the classification of himself as an impressionist because he wasn't an en plein air painter. He wasn't someone like Monet outside observing nature. Um, he was actually using really intense color um, to investigate scenes perhaps not of everyday life, but of certain themes um, that really intrigued him in um, his everyday life. What distinguishes this work is its extraordinary beauty, the density and freshness of the application of the pastel. Pastel is a fragile medium, and that you should find such a work where you have this incredibly dense application of pastel with such bright color is really remarkable, and it shows how hard he worked on it and how much he applied to begin with because it is a fragile evaporating medium. The color is incredibly remarkable, the patterning, but it's also the delicacy of her pose and how it really invites you to think about the dancer in an introspective, personalizing way. And it's immediately recognizable as Degas. It has this um, flair, but also delicacy, intensity, uh, but also softness to it um, that um, we see very little work like this today. Um, it's very 19th century, but yet also utterly modern. Mm -hmm.